my channel we have the most festive video for you today we are decorating the house for Christmas I'm so excited for this video I thoroughly enjoyed decorating the house this year and I just think it looks great in my own opinion so here I'm just fluffing out the Christmas tree this tree is from the range last year it was about a hundred pounds I think and all the branches come individually which make it so easy to store when you've got a small house um, so I really recommend it and I just think this tree looks beautiful it's got thicker branches towards the outside and it just makes it look so much more full and give a different like dimension to it so I absolutely love this tree <laughs> remember where these lights are from but they're mixed cool and warm lights my preference is warm lights for Christmas but I got given these by my mum and they were the perfect length of the tree so it actually looks really nice um, but I just would normally pick warm lights over cool <laughs> so quickly it's Christmas time again and even though we both get busy we still have time so most of my Christmas decorations are actually handmade by my mum so oh here she's dancing <laughs> um so I don't have actual links to them but I'm pretty sure most of them are from the range and then my mum added things to them to make them more decorative so that's where probably 90% of my decorations are from she's very clever and I absolutely love them our theme is always red and white with a bit of silver but I actually need to get more silver decorations because I realise when putting the decorations up that most of them are just red and white um, here is Connor showing his marble ball ball and it's quite painful to watch I'm sorry and then you'll see me getting annoyed about how he just throws it on the tree with no care so I do move that a bit later <laughs> So this tree display thing is from Home Bargains, it was £15, I got it this year and I just think it looks super pretty. I did add some foliage after um, just to bulk it out a bit more but I forgot to film that. Um, this was a very hard video to film because I'm constantly like moving things, adding things, taking things away so I'm sorry it's not the best video to show you what I'm actually doing but there is a complete walkthrough at the end of the video. Feel 
I didn't do this last year, but I got some snow spray. This was like 70p from Home Bargains, and it makes so much difference to the windows. And I absolutely love the effect it gave. So I just like randomly sprayed it to give the more rustic, snowy feel. So it looked like it was kind of snowing. Um, and I just kept pressing down instead of holding it down consistently. This hot chocolate station was hard to do. It took me ages to find a way that I liked it, but I went to B&M's and got these storage jars because they fit on the cake stand that I put my choc hot chocolate station on. Um, they were £10 for a pack of three and they're all stackable, so after Christmas we'll probably use them for teas, coffees and sugar anyway. But yeah, we've just got the Options White Hot Chocolate, the Galaxy Instant Hot Chocolate and some marshmallows which were from Aldi. I'm then filling up this little jar, I think this was from the range, with some mini candy canes which were from Home Bargains. Then this jar was from B&M's last year, I didn't see them this year, but I'm just filling it with the Celebrations Hot Chocolate mix which was from B&M's also. So I played around with this a lot. These little spoons are from Etsy and then the stirrers I'm pretty sure were from Amazon. Um, but yeah, I'm just mixing it around to see what I like best. And these little whisks are from Amazon also. So this chocolate is from Aldi. It's the Madagascan vanilla chocolate and if you have a velvetizer or a milk frother, put this in your machine because it tastes exactly like the white chocolate vanilla hotel chocolate hot chocolate sachets and it's a fraction of the price so I'm just chopping a bunch of this up and putting it in a container um, we normally put about 35 grams per cup in of chocolate um, in the velvetizer and it honestly tastes the same it's incredible to talk about my day all the time I wanted you Cold enough to make you shiver but not cold enough to snow Cold enough to know it's winter Scarves and sweaters bundled up in cotton Knowing names that wouldn't be forgotten Laughing over our own sense of humor Underneath the Christmas lights that Christmas time again And even though we both 
both get busy We still have time to talk for hours on end I'm glad I got to know better We've come so far since that Friend on 